high profile court case that we've been following for three years now. This weekend, it's taken another twist and turn. The case has come to be known as that of the Elkhart Four. And now Indiana's Attorney General has decided to get involved. These are the Elkhart Four. Just last month, the Indiana Supreme Court said that three of the four, Levi Sparks, Blake Lehman, and Anthony Sharp, should be resentenced just for burglary, not for murder, for their role in breaking into an Elkhart County home in 2012. None of them pulled the trigger, but the homeowner shot and killed their 21 year old friend and accomplice. Now, however, Indiana Attorney General Greg Zeller wants the state Supreme Court to rehear this case. He says the court made a mistake in overturning the murder convictions. He says they wrongly interpreted the state statute. For family members and friends of some of the Elkhart for this latest petition in the legal battle is tough to take. I'm ready for it to be over, but... If we have to keep fighting, then I'm willing to do that. Blake Lehman's mom admits it's discouraging and frustrating and will further delay the legal process, but she hopes the state Supreme Court will deny the attorney general's petition. We're going to continue our fight. I mean, we believe the Elkhart Four are murderers. They didn't kill anyone. Um, we think they should have been punished for the crime they committed. Now, we reached out to the Indiana Attorney General's office today for comment. We never got a response. Also, this latest development in this case actually only impacts three of the Elkhart Four. That's because the other defendant, Jose Quiros, pleaded guilty. We, of course, will continue to follow this case just as we've done over the last three years, and we'll keep you up to date on what happens.